Hello, ladies and gents. I am the Rev. We're back with more Everspace to the end game. We are getting real close to the end here. I don't know about you guys, but it always bums me out when I get to this point in games. I know we're going to be in, in things soon, but I thought I'd keep you with me just as we jump, just in, see, in case there's any more, uh, ch you know, chatter or anything from the main characters. So, if there is any more chatter, I'll cut back in. If not, Hi, apart from oh, your voice, here we go. is it possible to change aspects of your personality? Yes, that is possible. Is there any way to make you a bit friendlier, a little less cynical? Gee, Captain, you betcha. That's such a swell suggestion. A jolly hive makes for a happier ride. Oh, my sweet, scrappy, hell no. Stop that, please revert to default. I knew you would see reason. Because at this point, we wouldn't want to change his personality. That's just, just too perfect. The snarky AI is just part of the game. You know? Especially if you played the first one like, you know, we did here on the channel. It's all good. I like the snarky AI. He's got some of the best lines in the game. All right, here we go. Let's hope Shaw is as open to discussion as Marie de Vint was. Ah, Mr. Roslin. How nice to have you visit us again. I believe this is more than a social call. You'd be right about that. I need to have a word with you about your boss. Oscar Blakemore? He has long forgotten that our outpost exists at all. Supplies haven't reached us in eons. He has been preoccupied with other things, and causing quite a bit of trouble with the Okar. Let me fill you in. No need. We may be cut off from the center of affairs, but we're not completely blind to the events unfolding. I have been picking up bits and pieces from GMB internal communications, and have registered the rising tensions with the Okar. There's quite a degree of nervousness among my colleagues about this. There was also a recent raid on Vesna. I can put two and two together myself. Blakemore is undoubtedly the root of all this trouble. He's the worst thing to have happened to this company. And you are somehow involved. Yes, I was part of that raid. We failed. Now Blakemore has a fleet commissioner hostage. This is indeed serious. I'm waiting, Mr. Roslin, for you to get to the point. I think you might be the voice of reason in all this. You could talk some sense to the miners on Vesna and bring them around. That would be mutiny. However, Blakemore does need to be removed from his post and Okar assets left intact. There is a moment in every man's life where purpose becomes clear, and you have brought mine to my door. I shan't take much time to reflect on your proposal because it is clearly the right thing to do. What do you need of me? See, that's what I like about you, Shaw. You're straight up old school. I believe you're the most decent guy in GNB and will want to see things righted. Get together whatever fighting force you can muster and meet me above Vesna. If possible, use those GNB internal comms to tell the miners to down tools and stay out of the fray. You are a true man of action, Mr. Roslin. I must say, I have developed a real admiration for you. The admiration is mutual. Uh oh, I gotta restock something? Ooh, ship deep. Let's see, just... All right, clean up the old well, inventory. a lot easier than I anticipated. Ben. How are things at base? All clear. Preparations underway. Good to hear. I have Shaw on our side. Heading to see Cato now. Ancients are approaching. Combat appears inevitable. No, it doesn't. I wish I knew what they wanted. Yeah, they gotta catch me first. Later! 
Yeah, that is kind of weird. I've got fantastic news. Ice cream related, or is the coalition going to help? The second thing, not only that, they're even going to send their flagship, a drone carrier. Wow, Alec, you really are a legend. Wasn't that a given? All the pieces are nearly in place. Get ready to rendezvous above Vesna. I still got a call to make. You got it, buddy. Let's see, I think. Yeah, we won't have to jump through here to Prescott Starbase, so hold on. Like I said, if anything happens, I'll cut back to it. With such a gangster any other way i'll appeal to his better senses see what happens there is we're supposed to visit him for another thing too so we might have to go through that first see if the main story overrides Hi, i'd like a word with mr cato on an urgent matter you have been expected please proceed to the penthouse suite ah adam say have you ever tried gilbert guppies mm, they are delicious uh, no, I can't say that I have. Actually, I've got bigger fish to fry right now. Oh, yeah? And who would that be? Oscar Blakemore. Uh-huh. What about him? Would I be correct in presuming that opening up a new conflict with the Okar would be bad for your business? That would be an understatement. But why present hypotheticals? It would be the most likely outcome if Blakemore carries out his plans. I always knew that guy was going to cause big problems, but why would he go provoking any imbalance of the delicate equilibrium in our beloved DMZ? He wants to claim the region as his own personal fiefdom. He has plans to make it an autonomous entity under his direction. Now that really pisses me off. He should know there's only one boss in these parts, and that's me. I know how guys like this operate. I've met enough opportunists in my time. If you give them a finger, they'll take your whole goddamn arm and keep taking. Listen, I've no reason to distrust you, Adam. You've grown on me. But this sounds like it's even out of my league. I ain't in the position to take on something the scale of GMB. I've put together an alliance, Cato. GMB needs a change in leadership, and it needs a push to do so. I believe that if you join us, that will give us the strategic and tactical edge we need. We need firepower. We need more fighters. Wow. And to think the first time you wandered into my penthouse, you were just a nobody with an attitude. Yeah, sounds like I'll me. I'll tell you what. <laughs> Let me do my due diligence. I'll ask around about the state of things. And I'll get back to you as soon as I've made a decision. Don't take long, Cato. If you're not part of this, your name might not be worth much in the future. This is an opportunity. Choose your sides wisely. Oh, I get you, Adam. I have to say, I'm impressed. And a little unnerved by your methods of persuasion. Be advised, when continuing with the mission, your freedom to explore will be limited until you complete the storyline. We are how do you, yep, manual saves, prepare well before heading to the vessel, yep. Save that. Personal offense that you have not yet approached me to join your alliance. Tango, you already know about everything, I presume? I know more than I am comfortable with. I cannot sit idly by. Huh. I wasn't so sure where you'd stand on the matter. It is my fault for not being clearer about my position. A resumption of warfare with the Okar would not be in my or anybody's interest. This doesn't necessarily involve the Bovis. I am first and foremost a free citizen of the Beltagrades, and express my solidarity as such. I might be of technical assistance to your coming engagement. 
I bet anything you could contribute, Pango, will prove invaluable. Expect to hear from me. I will be in the background, plunging for intel, pulling strings. Okay, well, that's a everybody. Good thing. Let's get this show started. Gather in orbit above Vesna Mining Colony. Once we've arrived, there's no turning back. Let's do this thing! The Coalition is right behind you. We shall proceed immediately. See you there! The righteous moment of judgment has arrived. There we go, we got all but one. All right. To what extent do you uh, feel? Insofar as I am. Okay, so we are going where? Zarkov again, okay. Of many levels of intricate circuitry, I feel nothing physically. However, as I am an advanced intelligence capable of building relationships and forming independent opinions, it is possible for me to experience something akin to emotions in extreme circumstances, mostly tempered by my pragmatic outlook. That's an insightful answer. So you can form relationships? I would be unable to serve my pilots otherwise. Damn. Okay, so I'm not sure, but depending on how long the end of the game is, I might have to break it up if we go too long in the episode. So you guys keep that in mind going forward. I'll find a good spot. And you just have to wait for the next day. Hit that like button, subscribe, all that good stuff. Because I think things are going to get real nasty once we get to Drake. So hold on. Damn, a welcoming committee. Looks like Marita Vint got here first. There's no way we could have concealed an operation this big. Hey, she's taking a hell of a lot of fire. Marie, how are you holding up? Receiving a bit of a brutal beating, to be honest. I brought them out of their nest for you, at least. Everyone, spread out and draw some of that heat off the Duchess. We are engaging. Am I too late to the party? Terra, so Cato decided to lean in. The old man sends his regards. He's been drawing up blueprints for a new casino for this place already. Well, you can talk to Shaw about that later. So, your uncle sent you in his place? Yep. Said a little battle experience would put some hair on my chest. <laughs> Good man, Daryl. I'm certain it will. Yeah, I don't know about you. Oh my god, that's so many to fight. Alright, hold on. Woo-wee!
past him. Where'd he go? Ah, damn it. Go on, get your guys back up. Where are those? Uh oh, uh oh. No, they jumped out. Why they jump out? All that work I and we got a sense of exhilaration at the coming culmination of events. Haven't seen a battle this big in a long time. Brings back memories. Well, it ain't over. We can't wait any longer for the coalition. Prepare for descent. Not sure what we'll be facing down there yet. Maybe she changed her you mind. Made it through the blockade, but our base defenses will end your little adventure. Give up, Lake Moore, it's over. My carrier might be grounded, but it will be operational very soon. And in the meantime, we've been busy preparing for your return. That's not good. Set off all the fireworks at once. The coalition is here to assist. Ooh. Ming Yun, right on time. And just the firepower we need. See? I told ya! Deploying drones against surface installations. Tureen, Ghost, Alec, join me in securing the area around the control tower. Everyone else, support the coalition in their quadrant. Okay, so we're going up the main tower. Get some! Holy! I can't help but notice something's missing from the scene. The Commissioner's cruiser? Oh, uh, yeah. You say must have cracked the codes for commandeering it. Worrying, but we got more immediate problems right now. God, how do you... Jesus! How do I pull that thing up? Those are 
the big bads. on you and is threatening to destroy our fragile peace with the Oka. I have come with an alliance of selfless DMZ citizens to remove Blakemore from his post. I am appealing to you to cease combat operations and assist us in occupying the base. I offer my personal assurance that there will be no repercussions against you for any prior actions. It's working! Some of the fighters are turning away! Shaw, your voice of reason is what they needed to hear. It was your authority that cracked it. Can we get word through to keep the Commissioner safe? I'm presently in dialogue with a group of foremen, and this has already been conveyed. Enough of this! Uh-oh. Oh, that's a big gun. Oh, of course. Damn it. Any ideas how we can disable that thing? We need to act fast. We could cut off the power supply to take it offline. I'll mark the locations of power units you need to knock out. That should buy us some time so we can enter the control room and shut off the turret from inside. Thanks, Tammy. I'll do that. All right. 